CPS Technologies has absolutely taken off recently. I think about a month ago, it was trading around the $2 per share range, and today it's at $10 per share. Now, obviously, if you got into this stock a month ago, you're extremely happy right now. You're thinking about taking your profits, or maybe you're wondering, is this a long-term hold? Well, we're going to go over CPS Technologies, a little bit about what they do, but most importantly, whether or not this should be a stock that you keep in your portfolio throughout 2021. Now, with that being said, if it sounds like something you're interested in, let's get started. What's up, everybody? I'm Clay. I'm here to make 2021 the best year ever. We're going to grow our portfolios together, and we're just going to grow together. Now, if you like the content on this channel, please don't forget to click the like button. And if the subscribe button is still red, do me a favor, click the subscribe button, become a bro, and let's grow together. Now, CPS Technologies. I don't understand exactly the, the technology behind their metal matrix system that they've got going on, but in a nutshell, what they do is they've perfected the way of combining ceramics and metal into making different materials for various industries. So they're not just locked up into one industry, they're a materials supplier. So obviously this is good in the fact that they're not reliant strictly on one industry, and if that industry has a slump, they're going to have a slump as well. No, they're a materials supplier for various industries, so I do like this about the company. The next thing I like about the company is the fact that they've been growing their revenue over the last couple years. I think in 2017, their revenue was somewhere around $14 million. And over the last 12 months, they did 22, a little bit over $22 million in sales. Now, I always like to see a company that's growing their revenue. Obviously, that means that they're, they're growing their income. And this is a good sign. But the most important sign, one of the best things that I like about this company is that they went from negative net profit to positive net profit. Yes, in the last 12 months is when they were finally able to achieve a net profit on the bottom line. Now, it's not necessary for a company to have profit at the end of the year in order to be a good investment. Obviously, there's a lot of growing uh, sectors and industries out there, the energy sector, the mobile payment sector, things like that. We're going to see companies that have a negative net income at the end of the year strictly because they're so focused on growth and growing and getting that return and it, it takes there's a lot of growing pains that come along with new industries now cps technologies is in the positive so this is an awesome sign and it's making me very comfortable with this being a stock that we can hold into the future now with that being said if you already have this stock in your portfolio if you've gone from two dollars a share up to ten dollars a share if you five extra money that's completely up to you do I believe that we could see another 5x increase in this stock over the year? Absolutely. I believe it's possible. I think we're going to see a lot of spending from the energy sector, a lot of spending from the clean energy sector this year. And CPS Technologies is a provider for material solutions for the clean energy sector. So they could see a big boost from that and they could see their in their they could see their revenue increase as well as that bottom line. So this could be a good sign for the long term. But if you've already 5 x your money, that's completely up to you. A couple things that you can do, you can put a stop loss on and allow the stock to move. Allow, your, allow the stock to move higher, and if it starts to pull back and move lower, you've already locked in your gains and you're good to go there. If you're thinking about adding it to your portfolio, maybe in the week ahead, what do we need to see? We need to see the stock continue to rise. Obviously, with such exponential gains in a short amount of time, there's going to be a lot of people interested in profit taking, interested in selling those shares and booking those profits. Now, if that happens, we could see a drop in the share price. Now, could this be a good time to get in? It absolutely could, but we always want to make sure that we're buying a rising stock. If the stock starts to fall back and pull back to maybe $9 per share, $8 per share, let it start to go back up before we decide to get in and before we decide to add it to our portfolios. Now, with that being said, do I think that this could be an excellent opportunity for all of us? Yes, I do, but we need to make sure it's rising. So I just wanted to bring CPS Technologies to your attention. We have growing revenue. We have positive net earnings. We have a rising stock price. It's the perfect storm for a good position added to our portfolios this year, and I hope that all of you are well aware of what's going on with it. 
So with that being said, guys, if you like the content on the channel, don't forget to click that like button. If the subscribe button is still red, you got one more chance. Go ahead, click that subscribe button, join the channel, and become a bro, and let's grow together. So until the next time, I hope that all of you have an awesome day.